Hi everyone, this is my home built CNC hot wire cutter and I'll be the first to admit that it's a bit of a clunker. I'll start off with a quick walk around. This is the front with the computer on the left, the control box in the center and the keyboard and monitor on the right. This is the right hand side and this is the left hand side. The wing I'm going to cut today is for a mate of mine. It will be a symmetrical 15% thick section with a parallel cord and several extras. It will have a full depth 3mm thick spar, a conduit for the servo leads, top hinged ailerons and the leading edge will be a 4mm diameter carbon rod. And this is how the wing will look once it's finished. Okay, the block of foam has been cut to size and positioned ready to make the cut. I'll just get the cut started. Okay, the cut has started and the first thing that will happen is the software will preheat the wire for 10 seconds and then move it to the start position. Okay, the wire has been moved to the start position and then the, the wire will enter the foam and begin the cut. Okay, the cut's begun. It starts with the trailing edge and it will do the top surface first. As it progresses along the top, it will cut the 3mm spar, then go to the leading edge where it will do this cutout for the carbon rod. And then on the way down, when it's doing the bottom surface, it will do the conduit for the servo leads and the cutout for the top hinged ailerons. Okay, now it's doing the three millimeter spar. Okay, now it will continue on to the leading edge. Okay, now it's cutting the carbon spar leading edge. Now it's cutting the bottom surface. When I first built, got the machine fired up, I was quite surprised at how noisy those stepper motors were. Okay, now it's going to do the conduit for the servo leads. And it's continuing along the bottom surface.
Okay, now it's doing the cutout for the top hinged ailerons. And the, the cut's finished and the wire will return to the home position. Okay, that's it. Thanks for watching.